Well, many of us listen to the radio in the car or on a home stereo, but studies show that more people are starting to tune in online. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Sarah Blakely checked out an internet radio station in Calumet to find out what makes internet radio so popular. It's one of the first things you do when you get in the car. Turn on the radio to your favorite station. Recent studies show, however, more and more people are starting to listen to music through the internet. Pandora, Spotify, and Groove Shark are a few popular ones, but another station comes right from Calumet. WMET plays a wide variety of music from top 40 hits to blues to talk shows. Radio DJ Rich Buco says online radio is vastly different from other radio stations. It's a little more interactive. We're interacting with people on Facebook but at the same time via email, by a telephone. Uh, they're, they're tuned in a little more than they are to what they call terrestrial radio. And it has its advantages. The sound quality is excellent. The variety is, is great. There are no FCC limitations, so we can do almost anything we want to do. One of the things that sets an internet radio station apart from a regular radio station is the fact that no satellites are involved. WMET is able to broadcast their radio station in an office space completely with a wireless internet connection. And that wireless connection links the station with listeners across the world, from the UP all the way to Japan. John Grodoff says he got into internet DJing as a hobby. He says one of the best offers of internet radio is how easy it is to tune in. Internet radio is getting more easy to access. Um, simply with like a, if you have an iPhone, you can go into a Live 365 app and you can listen to us. WMET broadcasts 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Calumet.